and we are back. Today's map is going to be Hemeji Castle, 6 and turn time, rise for the progressive cars, bounce blitz dice, no alliances, no fog, no portals, but we do have blizzards. All right. We have the white player in the fifth position. I've only played this map one time, and it is one of the most choky, craziest maps to where you have to split anything and everywhere. The blizzards did not do it any favors. This is actually cutting off access here. This thing is ridiculous because all of these compartments, half of them do not connect. Like, look at that. You have three, 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 three. That is so much. So if you come in here thinking you're going to kill somebody, you have to uh, compensate for that. Much like one of the zombie mats like Mall of the Dead or Supermax Prison. Okay. Red player cannot hang and puts in here, which I know Orange did not want them to do. Um... So in that one game we played here a long time ago, we had this bonus, and it looks like 10 of our troops are there right now. We have three troops here. Orange still goes in, hits my one. We got three here, three here, and three here, and then 10 here. Now, black has five, six, but also has nine here. So I think I have to eliminate black from my quadrant if this is where I'm going. Purple's going to go for the middle. Now this connects here and here, but I don't believe... Yeah, you have to go sideways in here. You have to go separately here and here. Okay. And then this is blizzarded off, so you, don't even, you can't even slip around. You have to go in the back. Okay. Ooh, that completely cuts the castle course in half. Okay, then this is all one bonus. I think our best play is still this. Since it is a two guard, if you can get it. So I think... Oops, sorry about that. I'm going to head for that again. I could try to roll this turn one, actually. Get a plus two. Hmm. Which then would go into a two guard here. Um, uh, Red is there. The Red bought it out, right? The Red's a bot interesting so the bots actually gonna probably roll orange or take this for themselves Ooh, pink goes over there well i guess it just depends what do we want to do hmm. that is a lot of troops to wade through man um, well red has to slam orange first right Maybe I just kind of get out of the way and I take the plus two, guarantee a plus two turn one, and then don't fight black for that. And then black puts in there. Good dice on the two. Oh, perfect dice on the two. Perfect dice on the two. And yeah. Then I will fortify this here and get out next turn. Okay. I don't think black rolls my seven. I think he sees that I want to get out of there. He could still go here and push me out if he wants to. That seven's kind of blocking his access, though, so he probably doesn't like that. But I wanted to make sure I had access out onto the one instead of the pink three. Instead, black goes over here. Whoa. So my seven was enough to deter them. And now I can just have this for my income, and then I can work on this. Oh, baby. I like that. Yeah, bang, fortify, and then plump up. Oh, baby girl. I like how this is shaping up. Let's not get a little bit too excited here. Red player is General Cisco, who bought it out. Couldn't hang with the big dogs. Benny McFace, I played with like two months ago on a dragon, uh, dragon themed map. Um, it's the one. It's got really long bonuses. Um, it's not Draco Dracon Fortress. It's not Stairs of Knowledge and Power. It's uh, the other one, like dra um, Dragon Cannon. Dragon Canyon. I'm botching that. I'm sorry, but that's the one I played on. I really remember this guy. Uh, purple was General Arcada. Pink was Boyd Capadia. And then black is Bailey SM2002, who we have played with before, uh, I think two or three times on the channel. And also I noticed that they were in the KPO2 with us as well. So good luck, Bailey. All right. 
All right, orange does take the bonus or close. Ooh, what is that? Mr. Orange, he said, I don't want the plus three. Oh, I don't like that. Uh, not a big fan of this. So that makes me want to go here instead and start to branch out into the natural extension of my bonus. Purple goes, uh, dude, Is are they just going to give me this portion of the map? Um, interesting. I could hold here. This is a two guard for plus five. That is filthy. And that's no blizzard. That's a natural. Oh, no, it's this right here. Okay, it's not quite a two guard because red's here. It's not quite a two guard. Yeah, you can't actually. Okay, I do. For a moment there, I thought this extended all the way. I was about ready to say. Okay, so that's a natural three for three. Well, I could still do a three for it'd be a three for three, but into a three for five since this blocks that. Interesting. Very interesting. At the very least, I can have a one guard here. Yes. I can go bang fortify. Okay. Okay. Interesting. I won't rush it. But I'd much rather have a one guard. Uh, all right, and then fortify and let the bot do all the work for me. Oh, yeah, that's a money spot right there. Look at that connection. Okay, I like it. I like it a lot. Very cool. I was not going to play this map again because it is so choky and so aggravating, but I'm glad we're here. This is cool. <laughs> That's the thing with the blizzards. The blizzards can completely change the dynamic of the map from one game to another. As Black puts in their seven um, and rolls the eight into three. Wow, Black's having a tough time, and m mainly because Orange put an 11 there in the pipeline. What is he doing with that 11? Is he trying to get this? Brody had this in the bag. I don't know. I'm very, I'm very curious. I'm very, very curious. Okay, the bot puts in here predictably. Yep, it's gonna go for this bonus. Oh, but I'm in its bonus, dude. This is in part of its bonus. So now red is going away from us because we're too big. And now it's going for this bonus. Oh, that is immaculate. That is immaculate. Okay. So as long as this big stack is here, the bot shouldn't be able to take us unless it can uh, set and slam, which is really clean. Okay. Yeah. What does orange do? Does he just have an outlet stack? The only thing this hits is black seven, which is crippling. No one's going to get this in time. We're just going to snowball if this continues like so. Okay, orange moves. I think that means black moves. I really like this position as well. All the connections in these two areas. Really like this two stack. I'm the only one with a bonus. Pur oh, purple jumped the gun. They took the 5v2. Oh my god. They took the unforgivable roll. All right. They're just going to be set back one turn, but they lost a lot of troops for that. They lost their five stack on top of the plus four that they would have gotten. They should have just done that and fortified, I think. But you got to risk it sometimes, right? It's just that 5v2 will get you every time. That 5v2 will get you every single time. Mm hmm so if i was a man among men it'd be a one two <laughs> three guard for four bonuses which i guess is what we're kind of working towards i'm gonna, like, I'm gonna give black a bone oh i can't connect that two now okay my two stuck I, oh, right, because I was thinking I was going to hit this and then fortify. Yeah, I'm going to give Black a bone. Does Black come in here now, or does he go... No, he just leaves a stack. Okay. But as you can see, we're starting to prep. <laughs> we're starting to prep the, uh, the guard here. Because if we get this, I don't even want the village, per se. I'll, I'd rather have the two kill guards there, honestly. 
then the plus five. So I'll have two kill guards. Oh, okay. Red puts in here. Oh, that's the bot, of course. The bot's gonna mine that out. Yeah. Um, it might be. Yeah, it's too ambitious because orange is here actually. So I, forgetting that orange was here was actually a big mistake because now that's not gonna work. If someone has a big stack on your door, a trip guard for four bonuses isn't gonna work. No one's gonna let you have that. But I like red getting this bonus. That's pretty sick. And the key here is just to keep my stack open. Um, yeah, I didn't like being next to Black's uh, big stack anyway. So we're just going to move that over a little bit. And we're just going to slowly but surely creep up in troops here. I think I do need another bonus to really get this income underway. We just need these two. I think I can take it. I think I should roll this out. Yeah. Ooh, purple gets theirs inside of red. Okay. But doesn't break red. Ooh, okay, 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 okay. If I can remove red from here, he's going to put in here and slam purple. Oh my god, he's going to slam purple so big. Now, if I don't remove red, though, he might put plus seven and try to hit me, right? So I'm not too sure about that. But yeah, if red goes unchecked, purple could be in trouble and they don't even realize it. Red could also put in here and try to take. Okay, Pink continuing to try to get this bonus. Orange is slowing them down. This is a very intriguing game so far. Very intriguing. I could also just wield my my two in. Um, but I really, really don't want Red to plump next to me. I'm pretty sure Red breaks this. I'm going to go for it. I'm going to go for it, I think. Yeah. Get rid of red. Okay. Red might slam one of my 11s, but I think it's more likely that it slams purple here. I think it puts on the 3 and slams the 7 instead of putting on a 1 and slamming an 11. Oh, it could also break me here. But either way, we're still intact. Either way, we are still... Oh, wait, no, this is a two-guard. Oh, me and my blind self. I can't see worth Cracker Jacks. This was a two-guard the whole time because this is blocking. Oh, my gosh, I thought this connected. That is beautiful. It's going to slam here, especially if it sets. It's going to slam here. It wants to protect its bonus. General Cisco, right here. Please, goodness. Please don't go here. It's gonna. Yes, yes, everything. No, 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 no. More. We need more. We need more than that, sir. Oh, it's not gonna slam. If it does, that's not a good roll. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Multiple connections. It's gonna hit the one, not the seven. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Why use the side door when you can take the front door in? <laughs> Unbelievable. We go god mode for the second bonus. That was our birthright the whole time, and I should have noticed that earlier. But that's the key when you don't play the map a lot. You don't know all the connections. But now we do. Now we do. What an interesting turn of events. What an interesting turn of events. On top of that, I kept my stacks open. So this is still open that way. Now it is closed off into this portion of the map, but we are here and we're doing it live. And then if we go here, we have ultimate connections. Yeah, these blizzards are crazy compared to last time. I think I think the blizzards will always make this an interesting playthrough. We definitely didn't have that blizzard. Um, I think we had some blizzards here too. I don't remember seeing these guys as much. Interesting. Purple puts back in. Do they set to try to take back what's rightfully theirs? If they do, they're going to be slamming all their troops onto a bot, man. On all their troops onto a bot, man. All right. Now what I do, I feel really comfortable with a two guard on a plus five in the bottom left of the map. So I think we continue to take it slow as this is protecting both of our pride and joys. Um... Yeah, so I think we just use a card. We start taking with cards. 
Purple's very vulnerable. Ooh, they used up all their troops on red there. That's brutal. Purple's going to die, man. Purple's going to die a painful death. Either that or I just expand into this one, actually. I kind of like that. I kind of like that. Yeah. Oh, good dice. All right, I think that's clean. I like a 13, 16. All right, everyone's going to start setting. We get the fifth biggest set. The bots aren't even setting early, which is intriguing. If someone does sue into one of our big stacks, we will be able to repair it with our, our set. Wow, we are in a dominant position. This is crazy. All right. Red's probably going to set here, the bot. Bot sets early if they have it. If they don't, they're stuck on five. Either way, they're probably going to lock purple in here. They're going to take back what they lost, and then they're going to crowd in on purple. Oh, General Cisco does set. General Cisco sets, and he's going to go for this bonus as well as this. Or is he going to go? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, baby girl. Wow. Purple is stuck here. <laughs> Purple is praying. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, wow. Red didn't take that. That's crazy to me. All right. We have the best line on purple. Bang. And then, oh, we have to go through red. Oh, purple's stuck back here, actually. That's going to keep purple alive. So no, no kills, no kills. We just continue to plump up and look for our best option unless someone gets rid of purple and makes it easier to kill. Yeah, oh, this is very congested. You have an 11, 7, and 11 all from different players. In that case, we just continue to plump up. Orange puts in there. Okay, just going to get a card and pass. Puts everything else on his wayward 20. Okay. Fantastic. Takes out a little bit of a pocket there for himself. Interesting. Can't help but notice that you just unlocked my 13 going the other way, sir. Thank you, thank you. Once someone hits that, we'll have full access. <laughs> Purple sets in, breaks red again, of course. That's hilarious. All right, so I'm actually as far as I want to be as far as a two guard goes. So I don't think we push this. And purple can't actually guard both at the same time. Oh, there he goes. Yes, he's got to go into red to guard. I like it. I like it a lot. Good job, purple. Way to take back what's yours, baby. All right. I don't want to play this too passive, but I think trying to spread myself too thin is also an issue. I think I'm pretty satisfied with my two guard for plus five, honestly. Uh, that might be my downfall this game, is not wanting to press the advantage, but we can get Cocoa Bridge or South Road. Uh, or so South Road's that one. Okay. Cocoa Bridge is that one. Okay. Um... I think they're both fine. We'll do we'll do the bridge. All right, we have so many troops. Oh my god. I think I'm just going to use this for a card and then I'm going to plump these to kingdom come. And we're going to pass and see what everyone else wants to do. All right, I like that. We're just going to outscale everyone at this rate. We got a big set. We got two ma- Oh, we got a set on three as well. This is ridiculous. All right. Now, at that point, we're eyeing the bot kill, all right? We're just eyeing the bot kill. If purple gets removed here, he's done. He's so done. But I actually can't kill purple as long as that two is there. That's a lot of gymnastics. Okay, black looks like they're going to eliminate pink and myself. This is an important purple here as well. So black's feeling it. Bailey going in for their own bonus, plus four for farms, plus four for farms, rather. I like it. 
Now, Bailey's actually has 44 troops, but as far as geography goes, is all connected. I like that, though. Good play. Has a kill guard on purple. Yeah, it looks like the bot's going to be the best kill, so I just going to bide my time. Just going to bide my time here. Anyone have the territory bonus? No one has the territory bonus just yet. Purple's going to start spilling out, though. Purple can't go any further than this, though, or they'll hit me. So if Purple's smart, they won't actually come out here, or they run into my 25. Purple is so happy that they have these two kill guards. If not, they would be done so. If not, they would be done so. Okay. I can actually still get rid of this or... Uh, yeah, I can get rid of this one because then I still have access. All right, that's probably my play, just bopping that. Good man. Oh, but that's their kill guard. Oh, man. Purple's vulnerable. Purple is so vulnerable, dude. We lose to, like, teaming. We lose to people teaming up on us and trying to slam us. Oh, it's crucial that pink doesn't fully remove orange here. Okay, I was about to say. If pink removes orange, he's dead. If anyone gets fully removed from their position, we're the only ones that have been fully removed. Oh, wow, we have the red kill. We have the red kill if we want it. I'm going to be greedy and wait one more turn. I don't think anyone else is uh, brave enough to go for it. I'm going to be greedy, wait for one more turn, and see if red gets stuck on four. If red does, I'm going to go for the kill. Bang, 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 and bang. I just don't want to lose my position. And I'm only going to be able to do one fortification, so. Well, in actuality, I probably should run it with black, right? If I kill... I could also kill pink. Oh, maybe not. The splitting is so god-awful. The splitting truly is god-awful. All right, does red set and screw up everything? Does red set on three? If red set's on three, I regret not killing him. Delayed set. Bot always sets on three. Bot always sets on three. Have I learned nothing? But maybe I did, as it's going to slam purple with it. Oh, my lord. That is crippling. Oh, my god, dude. Purple is done, done, done. Buddy, old pal, save me from myself. That is so brutal. Yeah, dude, bot, bot always wins. <laughs> you know how the house always wins? Bot always wins. And actually, I'm feeling really good about the pink kill now. Split, split, bang, split, bang, bang. It's all connected, bang, bang. Yeah. We're just going to hit that. Okay, pink needs to set here. I kill them on five. Pink has to set here or I kill them on five. Purple has to set here or he dies as well. I think I can bust through the, the barricade to kill perps. Perp has to set here. Perp and pink have to set here. If not, this is going to be a bloodbath. This is going to be an absolute bloodbath. If purple didn't have the set and got slammed by the bot like that again, I think they might just bot out as well. All right, purple sets in, gets rid of red once again. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Had a whole coughing fit while purple set there. So red and purple set. Orange is very vulnerable. Oh, uh, pink didn't set. Pink's dead. All right, we set and killed pink on five. That's brutal. All right, let's just do this right. Let's just do this right. Yeah, it's more than enough. I'll put 30 here for good measure. Uh, I th Oh, that might have been a mistake. I don't think so, though. Yeah, that's more than enough. Split here. Alright, we go ahead and kill pink set. We get so many troops off of this. 
Orange is very killable to us as well, I think. <clears throat> yep. Uh, that's 13. Give me 14, 15. That can kill all of that. Then this goes there. Yes. Alright. Orange is dead, I think. Let's hold there. This goes in and out, right? Give me... Do I want red? No, red's the bot. Okay. Purple has two cards. We only need two cards for the set, right? Oh, we double set. Holy Cracker Jacks. Well, if we kill red and purple... Four and then split. That kills that. That kills that. That kills both of that. And then I kill... Yeah. I'm going to save black for last, I think. Okay, kill. we don't set here. We got to keep going. Red dies, the bot. We have to split here. Uh, Alright. Get the double kill. Oh my god, this is textbook. This is textbook. GG in Fiji. Holy Cracker Jacks. I think that's enough to kill Black as well. Um, 21. Oh, that is enough. Yeah, because I have my 11 there as well. Alright, I think that's game, big guy. Oh, we got dot god dice. I wasn't expecting that to win. I was not expect we could have lost there because of the the split. Um uh, what's the best line? I think I go. Um I think that's got it. Yeah. Well played, dude. Holy Cracker Jacks. What a massive, massive win. I will take that. Himaji Castle? Himeji Castle. Whew, that was insane. Poor Purple. That bot had him on lock. Orange was a master? Wait, what? I thought the last time I played with Benny, he was like a beginner. If that's the case, I want to go back and look at that game and see how much he's grown. That's incredible. Pink was a master. Black was an expert. Incredible game, guys. Shout out. Bailey SM, you're a great player. Boyd Capadia, General Arcada, Benny McFace from downtown, my guy. General Cisco was the bot. As always, thank you so much for your time. I really do appreciate it. And I will catch you on the flip. Peace.